Welcome back to State Champs. This week we go in focus to the MHSAA's Student Advisory Council, a way that student athletes can be involved and become leaders. Let's check it out. The Michigan High School Athletic Association has been the governing body of over 1,500 public and private high schools in Michigan since 1924, promoting sportsmanship, scholarship, safety, and a sensible scope in school sports. Over the last decade, the MHSA has invited students to help them do just that. So about 10 years ago, we started talking about ways to get students more involved. We're always talking with coaches and athletic directors and officials, superintendents, all the adults, but we weren't really talking directly to those people who we are directly affecting. Um, so we decided to figure out a way to work with kids. A number of other states were, had an advisory council like this. and so. We took their lead and, and we started and, and it's been a great experience for us. No matter what they are discussing, the Student Advisory Council gives kids an influence on policies. We are the voice of the student athletes in our area. We bring issues from the student's perspective to our perspective, to the perspective of the administrators here at the MHSAA so they hear about the problems from the voices of the students. I think it's a huge deal because a lot of the students in high schools want they don't really voice their opinions enough to adults or they might be shy. So I think it's a great opportunity for us to kind of serve for them. The board consists of eight juniors and seniors every year from a variety of high schools. We get a lot of great applicants to be on the council. And to be honest, it's kind of a puzzle. We want to make sure that we get all areas of the state represented. We want to get as many sports represented. So we have way too many qualified candidates and we only get to choose eight every year giving everyone on the council great connections and leadership. This experience, this group, has really taught me how to be a leader and what kind of a leader I am and what different traits I can use to be the best leader that I can be. And so when I'm on my cross country or my track team next year in college, I can use that. For State Champs, I'm Stephanie Funkhauser.